How's it going, Wielder Pumper Nichols? My name is Eric Van. I was so wrong. And welcome back to Alice Mare. So why was I wrong, you may ask? Well, in the last episode, I thought the absolute worst about the story with Chelsea with Little Red Riding Hood. I was like, oh, the wolves like raped her or something. But I was thinking the worst. Now, what truly happened was that the father killed the wolf in front of Chelsea. And that was traumatizing for her because there was red everywhere and there was blood. And Chelsea was just absolutely terrified. And that's what I just assumed the worst because in these RPG horror games, sometimes the worst is what happens. And well, oops, I think it's the dark side of Little Red Riding Hood. It really just put me in a, in a bad place about these kinds of things. So anyways, let's go to the next area. It's locked. Well, I guess we gotta... No, what? I got... I thought I got a key. Oh, do I gotta go back and talk to the White Rabbit, don't I? The White Rabbit gives us permission to get into the next room. Welcome back. I say with a smile, but I'm made quite uncomfortable by that face you're making. Why? It's it's because I've gone through some torture and trauma too. I had to kill the wolf with my own hands. I did what the father did. Ah, well, at least you seem to have safely recovered the key. A job well done. Well then, I'll collect all the things from that world, and I'll put together those pages. Here you are. Obtained a vermilion notebook. Now then, I'll open the door to the next world. I'm counting on you once more. Oh, that's good. I'm glad you you count on me. I'm Mr. Allen, the mother killer, the wolf killer. I'm I'm uh, I'm a good killer. Allen, you're a killer. You are good at killing. Oh, hey, it's the cool dude. Yo, hell, it's nice weather, huh? You know what this calls for, you know? Yeah, 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 let's play. Oh, he does let's plays too? Oh, that's a lame joke. Okay, let's not. Whoa, yes, yeah, sweet, all right. Open up that closet. Okay, I'm, I'm opening it. Oh, I'm opening it, let's go. Your hand trembles. Why? Just open it. What's gonna... I know something bad's gonna happen, but let's just get the badness over with, okay? Oh, he's a rich boy. Look at that. He's got, like, banners. Okay, that's my head. <laughs> he's got banners over his bed and a lamp and a TV and gold medals. What did he do well? Is it for fashion or something? A dice game. A dice game? He's a gamer. A book label. Let's let's read this Mother Goose book. The Mother Goose book is never good. Yankee Doodle came to town upon a Kentish pony. Stuck a feather in his hat and called him Macaroni. Is that actually how it goes? I don't remember that. Lots of hats and clothes because he's rich. Oh, he's- oh, he's rich alright. Look at this house. This is the biggest one we've been to yet. One is red, but all others are black. Only one is red. Yeah, I see there's a red chest. It's kind of pink, though. The back of one is six. The back of three is four. The back of two is five. Because it's dice. The letters have been smudged out. It's five. Duh. It's dice. He's a little gamer, isn't he? He's a little gamer. Lots of hard-to-read books. I feel glad that I finally got a puzzle in this game. The other ones, the last time I failed really bad. Who are you? What the hell? Back, back, front. Behind, forward, forward, which? One, four, six, two, it's five. One, four, six, the back of two is five. Back, don't know, back. Okay, let's get some XXXX in my life because all them pornzos, baby. He has a beard. <gasps> I do too. This is, wow, some royalty or something. Look at this place. There's swords on the wall. It's locked. Okay, that's it. I'm out of here. No, I don't don't want to be here. It's locked. What kind of fairy tale is this going to be? For some reason, you can't proceed any further. Why? I got to solve the puzzle, but I already did. It's five. It's five. Oh, do we got to do the backs of all these numbers? The back of one, four, six, and two? Okay, so one is six, so it should be six... Three, six, three, one, five. Should be six, three, one, five. I got it. Six, three, one, five. It better be at six, three, one, five. Boom. Uh, eight, ooh. one, four, six, three, one, five. I got it. Give this. I got it. Ah, ha, ha, I'm smart. That didn't take me long. Yay. The moon fell. That great big round moon fell. When I told mother, she looked surprised, surprised, then smiled slightly. The moon hadn't fa really fallen. It still looked down on us from the sky, but I liked the face mother made, so I told her all sorts of things. I saw a big lizard talk. I saw the old man next door fly. I saw a cat swimming in the lake. You're a fibber. Every time I said something, mother would be very surprised, then laugh a lot, but she gradually stopped laughing. After that, mother stopped looking at me. Oh, jeez, mother was tired of your shit. That's what happened. I wonder if there's going to be the boy that cried wolf. The one who always wants attention and then people stop believing him. Could very well be it. Okay, I opened this door, didn't I? I did? Oh, here you are. Hmm. 
Huh, Alan? Jeez, made me jump. No, nothing's locked. All the doors are wide open. This was locked. Teacher? Nah, I don't know. I want to ask if this is a dream, but it's a dream. Must be, right? It looks like my house, but it's way smaller. Yeah, I've been having the same dream a bunch lately, but nobody's around, so I just sit here alone. We are just part of a big experiment, that's what. We're a part of a big experiment. But good to see you here, Alan. Let's go somewhere. The teacher's experimenting on us. Who knows? Maybe we'll find somebody else. Uh, what's with that look? Uh, sorry. I'll follow Alan. Anywhere's fine by me. Thanks. Well, yeah, I've been through some serious shit, okay? I like dice more than the games you play with them. So I'm always rolling dice when I'm alone. It sounds boring. Dice is- it's just a tool to play games with, okay? I could use a random number generator if I really wanted to. Well, some people have weird obsessions. Okay, can we go up yet? What's up? What? You, can't you go up there? You can't climb stairs, Alan! What's with that look? It was a joke! And your joke sucks. And your joke's stupid. This is big. You can't read it. I wasn't born here, you know? Actually, I forget where it was, but I guess this is the language there. People in different countries have different hair, eyes, even food. It's pretty cool. Teacher's eyes were all black. I wonder where he was born. Well, I don't know. A lot of people have black eyes. I guess they're kind of like brown, blacky eyes. Hey, are you Teach? Hey, Teach. Is, it, is, is that you? Huh? Teacher's here. Ah, what? You just, what? Gah. Alan and Joshua, hmm? I know I keep telling you, but would you stop hitting me on the hip so forcefully? Yeah, well, you never notice if I don't do that, teacher. Ah, gee, ooh, what are you doing? <laughs> stop it. Ahem, not on the flanks either. Anyway, why are you here? I mean, I guess anything can happen in a dream. It's not quite a dream, personally. I'm surprised by the fact that Alan is here. You stay here. Don't even move if possible. Don't go any further than this. I'll be leaving soon, so be careful. Oh, you're gonna be gone forever. We're gonna have to leave. What's this? A scrap of paper. It was in teacher's pocket. What's that look? Teacher was like half asleep. It's fine, I tell you. You thief! You just do whatever you want. Plus, I swapped it with a toy spider. That's gonna scare the crap out of teacher. You want this? Boy, you're weird. Here. Obtained a notebook scrap. Oh, I wanna read. Ah, I don't want it anymore. That's scary. One day I said that father had gone cold while he slept. Mother was more surprised than she had been in a long time. Very surprised. Then she got very angry, but I didn't stop. Almost daily I said that father had gone cold. You're so bad. She was surprised every time and got angry every time. Of course, you don't just joke about that shit. You're all like, hey, guess what? Your sister died. Or something like that, or the person that you love. You don't joke about it. That's so bad. I liked it. Because she'd only talk with me when she was surprised. Holy fuck. Man, what the heck? If it's not a dream, what is it? I never get the stuff teachers going on about. Oh, huh. Maybe I'm just an idiot, you say. Alan? Oh yeah, you are dumb. I already said it, you're dumb. Because this is about you, the story scraps are about you, and you're just dumb. You're dumb, I don't like you. Alan, let's play Russian Roulette. No, I don't want to play Russian Roulette, it's about shooting yourself, no way. No way, Joshua. I'm saving my game, I don't feel comfortable around you, Joshua. You little tool, Russian Roulette. One of us would get killed or something. Or we'd injure ourselves. No, that's just... That's just a path to a bad ending, I have a feeling. What the heck? Don't open that! Uh, nothing. Sorry to startle you. Why? I wanna open it. It makes me wanna open it. Shouldn't open this. <laughs> Shove it, Joshua. You're stupid. No, I don't- I fucking no. You and your new Tetris. Ba ba kilo ba desi ba. What? Ba ba kilo desi. Kilo desi! We're gonna have to do some math stuff, aren't we? There's a little bit of space on the shelf. I gotta find a book. Hey, don't mess with that. You know what I mean? There are things a man's gotta have. Oh, you got pornos under there? Or, or something, probably. It's packed with books. Where do I find a book? It's locked, shit! Hmm? Weird, it was open before. Why'd it close? You said all these doors were open, Joshua. You're such a liar. Hmm? I don't like thinking. I know you don't. You definitely don't, from what I know about you. You, you just don't like thinking at all. Alan, you take the lead. I'll do it all. Good. Cake. Can't go eating this with our hands. The cream will get them all sticky and it'll ruin our clothes. It won't ruin your clothes. You just have to wash them. You're so fucking... What a pretty boy. Uh, awesome. Awesome. These are my father's, so he gets mad if I touch him. Tell me not to, though. It just makes me wanna. Oh, I'm just 
Flynn. Ah, uh, what? K H D M D? Oh, shit. I, oh, I don't fucking know. Uh, C. Bah! Says you're right. Why is it C? Why is it C? I don't know why it's C. I just guessed. Oh, I see. Length. I knew you were sort of centimeter. Yay! Yay! There's a little bit of space on the shelf. Yay! Oh, the lock is open. I opened the shelf. Obtained a grabby. I just don't even know what's going on anymore. A grabby arm? What do you mean a grabby arm? Man, I remember this thing. Is it a thing like when you're small, you reach up for stuff like on the top of shelves? Is that it? I used to use this to drop snake skins and stuff from above. Yeah, of course you would. Of course you would. What? Where, where am I going to use this? Oh, hey, maybe we can eat the cake now with the grabby arm. Can't go eating this with our hands. We got a grabby arm. That just probably wouldn't work that way. Like pfft, putting it in your mouth. No way. Um, sure, a uh, grab, 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 grab de boo boo. Oh, hey, there's something under the bed. Yeah, use the grabby arm, sure. Uh, I got a blue book. And we're gonna put that book here. I've been waiting to find where that <laughs> was. It fit perfectly. Of course it did. And I just unlocked myself out of it. Oh, why now? Why did, did what? Did I open the. Why? Ah, ah, ah. It's hanging a little loose. There we go. We can remove the painting. Good. There are two small forks behind it. Hey, we can eat cake with these. Take one. I can't believe we did all that for a cake. God, that's that's tough. I don't even want the cake anymore. No way. I worked way too hard for this, but okay, whatever. Let's eat it. What? You felt dizzy. Oh no, someone drugged the cake. I... God, those drugs are crazy. There's a scrap in your pocket. Tainted notebook scrap. I was locked in my room. I mean, I had TV and I had toys, but it was different. Of course it was, right? They'd look at my sister and brother, but not at me. If only spiders and frogs could talk, I wouldn't be so bored. Yeah, I was different. Why? Yeah, you were different because you're a lying son of a bee, Joshua. That's creepy. Oh, this is creepy. There's eyeballs. Let's talk to the eyeballs. Gr <laughs> gross. Oh my god, gross. It's an eyeball. That's a shard of XX. Yeah, XX, you can't hide from me forever. Okay, I'm gonna get those pornos. Of Let's look inside. I'm gonna- Ah! I regret it. Okay, how about we look in this one? This is a different one. Ah! You're big. This person keeps on looking on the other side. It gives you an eerie feeling. Of course it's eerie. You can't read it. Yeah, I know. We're in a foreign distant land and this Joshua person's from a very- Oh, jeez, Louise! Oh, psh, Oh, my God. This place is not good. Okay, let's look inside. Of course, it's another eye. I should be remembering the colors of these eyes, shouldn't I? This one is yellow-orange. Gotta remember that. Yellow-orange. There's gonna be a puzzle or something about what color are the eyes. I got a feeling in my pants about this. Okay, red. Red, yellow, green, and blue. Green and blue. Red, yellow, green, and blue. Right? Oh, it's the direction where they're looking. Oh, no. I didn't know that. Fuck. Blue is looking to the right. Oopsies. Just cut your losses. It's only time. Time is something that you have. Up. Yellow eyes. Oh, shit. That one was right. Don't look. What? Whoa. Don't look. I want to look, though. I want to see my own demise. Don't poke my eyes out. What's this? A key. Take it. Of course, I got the world key. There's also a scrap of paper. Let's learn about Joshua's past. Father went cold, he really did. I told mother, but she didn't believe me. She didn't believe anything I said anymore. Quite some time passed before my brother and sister noticed, and she finally realized. She made a face I'd never seen before. A face I didn't want to see. There wasn't surprise or anger or smiling or laughter. After that day, mother stopped saying anything. Because of you, Joshua, you stupid idiot! She was just silent, coldly staring somewhere. That man, this feels kind of strange. I feel really fuzzy, like I'm missing something. But I don't know what it is I'm missing. Alan, you have anything you're scared to lose? No. Hmm. I'm a little envious, but it must be real painful. Sure is dark, but it's kind of relieving. Is darkness supposed to be this comforting? Well, yeah, everyone is has had some psychological trauma in their past. I don't really want you to go in, or to go in myself. Are you gonna? I'll go in, of course. Okay. 
I'm in. Oh, and the mom killed herself, didn't she? Huh? Click! Clack! Good job getting here! Told you not to, didn't I? Hey, Alice! Oh, should I have not gone in here? Don't care about me, huh? You that curious about that doll hanging there? Huh? Doll, no. That's mom. That, that's my mom, isn't it? No, wrong. Wrong. Mom doesn't have those eyes. Oh, well then, which eyes? Tell me why, don't you? Ah, so he was like mom's eyes. He was so fixated on them. That's why we're seeing all these eyes here. Well, ah. Oh my! That- oh my god, I gotta- <laughs> I gotta read this better, I gotta switch the voices better. That's not my mom, it's not, because back then what I said- What I said was- what I said, ooh, but mom, she- This is wrong, yeah? This isn't right? Why are you looking at me like that? Why did I have to see this? Now, what's this about? What happened back then and this result, it's all your fault, ain't it? I think so, because he was like, I wonder if, I don't know what this fairy tale is. I think it's like the boy who cried wolf because he keeps on like lying over and over again. But there might be another one that I just don't know about. I don't know. Fish around all you like, you won't find any reason why you're not to blame. And trust me, going down the if only I'd root is just a waste of time. Stop it! Stop. Ah, sheesh, if you say so! Smell ya! Yeah, good. Go traumatize someone else. I've had enough of you traumatizing me, okay? Hey, I'm glad I made a decision to go in here, because I guess I could have died if I didn't, because there's wrong and right decisions, right? My big brother's good at soccer. My big sister's smart. But I'm nothing. I'm nothing, but I said I'm something. I have nothing, but I said I do. And I got so sad after I said that. Soon enough, I didn't know what I had or what I was. No matter what I say, it might just hurt someone. But I still sat up. Teacher, what am I supposed to do? The words toward the end are a bit too blurred to read. Wow, that's pretty creepy, Joshua. I gotta say, you have a pretty creepy past there. Okay, let's start the next world. Why not? Welcome back. Oh, your expression is different from, from the last time. Ah, no, I believe I understand. Well then, I'll collect all the things from that world, and I'll put together those pages as always. Here you are. I got turquoise that time. Now that'll open the door to the next world. I'm counting on you once more. Yay! Count on me! Call on me! Call on me! I think this is gonna be the teacher's door, isn't it? Well, let's just wait for then. Oh yeah, it's you! I forget your name, but you were the one who was very sullen. Oh, dear Alice, what is it? Ah, yes, you'd like to play very well. What shall we play? Anything's fine. I love it how we can say, let's not play. Hey, let's not play. That's what Al- or sorry, not Alice, that's what Alan would do. Shall we open the closet? Yeah, let's get in there. Let's get in there. Let's go into the closet. Let's come out of the closet together. Oh my goodness, I don't like how we just woke up in a cemetery. Things don't bode well for us. Um, yeah, let's, okay, let's go through this maze. I can solve mazes, okay? First try, I'm gonna make no wrong turns. I just made a wrong turn. Oh shit. Well, that's too bad, isn't it? Okay, obviously follow the blood trail. The trail of spilled tomato juice. Mmm, delicious. We can drink that up. We've been in this dream for far too long. We deserve some tomatoey goodness. Okay, I went the wrong way again. Congratulations, me. Just go through the middle. Don't ask questions. Invisible barriers and all that. Hey, get the mushrooms. Let's do some mushrooms, Alan. Actually, then again, we're already tripping a lot of balls. I don't think mushrooms are gonna do us any good. Hey, more mushrooms. Mmm. Have a taste or leave- let's leave them be! I'm gonna save my game. Let's have a taste, actually. I like mushrooms. Mmm! They have an ominous color. Mmm! Oh, delicious! Oh, um, um. Mm. Okay, we're out. No more mushrooms for us. Where? Teacher, is that you? Let's talk. Okay. Oh, Alan. You're here, Alan, which means I see. Teacher, what's up with you? you? See, the teacher is up to something because the teacher's visiting all the students here. I want to know what the teacher's doing. Thank you, teacher. That will be fine. You need to fix up your hair as well, teacher. 
No, I'm, I'm fine. I have no time to cut it, and I don't know how. And that means you can't? Surely you could just fumble it. No, I'd really need to know. Besides, that's not the kind of thing I'm interested in knowing now. I didn't quite catch that. That's a weird conversation. It's boring standing around. Come, let's go somewhere. Ellen, I'll follow behind you. Of Everyone, why are you following me? Do I have just natural leadership qualities? Would you follow me? I'm sure it will be amusing whatever path you take. Stella. Isn't this fine? Nothing can come of staying in the same place. What will you do, teacher? You told me to stay here because I was on my own. Yes, well... You don't really listen to me, do you? I'll come with you. So it's settled. Well, Alan, we're counting on you. Oh, you guys are all coming with me! You- I love it how teacher's name is just teacher. You guys have some pretty high expectations of me, okay? Why would you want to follow me? I haven't even said any words to you. I'm just a silent protagonist, like... Mm, mm. And they're all like, hey, we're gonna follow you, and I'm just like... Thinking to myself, I wish I could talk, but my lips aren't moving! Like that. Just like that. Exactly. Spot on. Sure, mazes. I like mazes. Just going through the maze. Ha! Ah, no wrong turns this time. I wonder what happens if we fall down a hole, though. I'm sure something good. Wee! A hole in the ground. Let's go down it. You never know. It could lead you somewhere good. Some scrumptious stuff. Some more scrumptious mushrooms. Of course, follow the tomato juice. Um. Oh, hey, there's XXX up here. Ooh, yeah. Three's a party. Three's a party. Let's go do some XXX. <laughs> XXXX. That's even more hardcore than XXX. Okay, let's. We got. There's something in this tomato juice. We gotta get it. Tomato, tomato. Mm -hmm. Hey, you listen. I'm a spider. I was dozing off when somebody took my legs. I can't walk like this. Can't even look from. I think if we reattach your legs, it's not gonna work. Unless we have a surgeon amongst us. So you a surgeon for him instead. Yo, no response, huh? Looks like the big dude back there is thinking hard. You boy, I'm counting on you. Fail me and I'll eat you. Ah! Alan, what is that bug going on about? I see his legs. I'm not doing a thing. You do it, Alan. All of it. Or else I'll have to toast you and eat you. Oh, that's how she is. Stella's all about, like, getting other people to do her stuff for her. It's like, you do this. I'm a princess. I'm a princess. I'm more important than all of you. But I'm... Stella! Blah. Okay, that's how I imagined it. Where am I supposed to go? A little hole a person couldn't fit inside, but perhaps someone about my size could. Yeah, go in there then. Let's put you down in there. I want to throw you in there, Stella. I'm going to put you in the hole. Okay, anyways, guys, I'm going to end the episode here. In the next episode, we're going to pick up right where we left off. We're going to find those spider legs. I kind of wandered back here, even though I probably shouldn't have. And, uh, yeah, we'll just go from here, and I imagine, well, there's only one person left, which is Stella, and then I imagine the next door is gonna be for the teacher, and we're gonna find out all bunch of crazy stuff about the teacher, and so I might finish it in the next episode, depending on how long the ending is, but I'm not entirely sure. If I do finish it in the next episode, it's gonna be, like, a really long episode, which I might just do anyways for the heck of it, but I might split it up into two parts, not entirely sure. Either way, I'll see you then. If you did like this video, remember to headbutt the like button as hard as you can, and I'll see you then. As always, guys, peace.